At 5-4, and four, the Powers Catholic Chargers weren't sure if they'd even be in the playoffs, but the group that gathered last night to watch the selection show were more than happy to see their name on the screen. If they were happy to see their opponent's name, well, that remains to be seen. The Chargers take on the 6-3 and three Eagles from Frankenmuth this Friday, but Powers actually gets the home field advantage thanks to their playoff point totals from beating four Class A opponents in the regular season, plus a Class B opponent that had a lot of wins. Longtime coach Bob Buckle admits this will be a tough test for his team, but they just spent a good part of Monday afternoon watching film on the Eagles. So we asked him, what do the Chargers need to do to beat them? Frank was a pretty good football team. Uh, they have a real outstanding quarterback, a uh, couple of outstanding uh, running backs. And uh, two years ago, I worked at their Veer camp, so I, I know that they're, they have a system of offense that's uh, one that's been very productive for them. So we have to slow them down. Obviously, when you're uh, playing a, a Veer team or an option team, you, you have to stop the quarterback, and that, that will be where we'll try to concentrate our efforts. And also, uh, we have to move the ball and score, and we've been uh, pretty inconsistent lately in that area, so that, that's probably our bigger concern is moving the ball on their defense. 